guys! Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a very special guest. This is Brooke. She's my best friend since fifth grade, and I'm lucky enough to have her visiting me today. And we are going to be doing a DIY to these pots in front of us. We're just going to make them look cute and boho. Get some boho vibes in here. <laughs> Get some boho vibes. Just to give you guys a little bit of context, I was planning to do this DIY by myself and I got a text from Brooke very, uh, not very early in the morning, but I got a text from her that she was in town and that this would be the best day for us to meet up. So I thought, hey, um, why not you help me do this? And she was obviously down to help and that's kind of how things got started. While I was painting these plant pots, I kind of had this um, open for inspiration. I just type in boho plant pots into Google and just look at what they have. I think I might have used this one as an inspo and just it's fun to just look at the different types of plant pots that they have. Um, so I would highly recommend doing that. I tried to make a Pinterest board, but honestly it was just easier to use Google Images. So Brooke had an idea to use this green spray paint to, spray, to paint over these IKEA um, pots. They're like the metal ones that are super cheap. And so that's what we're doing here. Did you film, hold the camera like this? <laughs> no. <laughs> Rookie mistake. So just a tip, when you're using spray paint, you want to do like short strokes. You don't want to spray too much because that causes dripping. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah, I see a little dripping over here. I think I got pretty good coverage. Mm -hmm. I think we're good. So how does it feel like setting off on a new adventure? Um, it's exciting, exhilarating, I feel free, I more of my own autonomy after being posted up with family for the quarantine, mm -hmm. and, um, but it's also not really exactly sure what it's going to be like where I land, mm -hmm. what, exactly what work I'm going to be doing, I know it field, um, but there's a lot of things in the air, and I kind of, I, I feel like for the most part I've been thriving on those kinds of experiences and yeah. I'm not really sure what you're I'm not, stepping into. You're not a stranger to that. But that's one of the things about you that I love because you've done so much in your like short life that nobody will ever, ever, ever do. You know, like I'm just getting started. <laughs> Sorry. Like who just sails around the world in there? How old are you? I started sailing when I was 24. But you'll look back and be so glad you did it. Like, no, you're already glad you did it, but then... Oh, I gained an invaluable amount of information and... <laughs> but man, things get real rough and emotional at sea and the communal living and yeah, because you're it's just you and I guess the people that you're with and there's not a lot to distract you from. I'm yeah, assuming. if you're doing yeah, if you're doing a crossing for sure, which I did quite a few. So yeah, even. Even if you're on a boat for five days with, with the same people, you know, depending on how big your vessel is, how many people you have with you, I mean, it 
personalities clash, and it's a lot different than sharing a space on land that's stationary. Mm -hmm. You know, and depending on what the setup's like, it might be, you know, it always takes longer to do things in a group and deciding where you're going to go or yeah, who's cooking dinner or whatever, you know, there's a lot. You can find planners like this at your local Lowe's or maybe you have a mom and pop. Place well, those I got at Target. No, I know you're going to say something about Target. It's bad. Okay, okay. I won't even say it. <laughs> what were you going to say? Well, we can just try and support our local mom and pop shops, yeah, especially after that. this, if there's anybody if there's still anybody open and out that. there. Do you feel like we're the same people we were when we were when we first met? I mean, I think there's, we're still, we're an adapted and evolved version of those young people. Mm -hmm. But yeah, obviously we're the same, <laughs> <laughs> the same, in the same body, and there's still yeah, some personality we're... traits that are the same, but evolved. Mm -hmm. So eventually my friend Brooke did leave and I had to finish up on my own, which was fine. I had a lot of fun the next couple of days just kind of painting these plant pots and making them look cute. So without further ado, let me show you the finished product. thanks for watching I hope you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you liked it and consider subscribing I have an awesome video coming up soon for you guys it's gonna be a makeover of my balcony and I just can't wait to show you guys so stay tuned for that and have a great one bye